Welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I'm Roshni Dhan. Let's look at today's top headlines. MBBS interns, PG Medicos, to now conduct regular health checkups of school children under PM Potion Scheme. In a major step towards health development at schools and at the same time providing practice exposure to medical students, the National Medical Commission has directed MBBS interns and PG Medicos to conduct regular health checkups of school children across the country under the Prime Minister Potion Scheme. In a letter addressed to deans and principals of all medical colleges, the Deputy Secretary at the NMC, Dr. Ashish Kumar Panda, has asked the authorities to depute interns and the PG students of medical colleges to do the health checkup of school children whenever requested by the concerned state or union territory government authorities. MTP cannot be denied merely because woman is unmarried, Supreme Court said, by giving relief to a 24 weeks pregnant woman. Dismissing the Delhi High Court order which had barred an unmarried woman from terminating her 24 weeks pregnancy from a consensual relationship, the Supreme Court on Thursday provided ad interim relief and allowed her for abortion. However, the note from the top court bench is subject to the note from Ames Delhi Medical Board which must conclude that the abortion would not cause any risk to the life of the woman. Aims steady to get its new director by next week. The Orland Institute of Medical Science Delhi may get its new director by Wednesday next week with the appointments committee of the cabinet headed by Prime Minister Narendra Modi expected to select the candidate for the top post at Aims. Zydus gets nod from US FDA for blood pressure injection. Zydus Life Science Limited has received final approval from the United States Food and Drug Administration to market noropinephrine by trade injection USP single dose vial. Noropinephrine by trade is indicated for restoration of blood pressure in adult patients with acute hypotensive state. The drug will be manufactured at the group's tropical injectable manufacturing facility at Gerard, India. That's all for today. Stay safe. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.